Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're new here, I am Mimi with the Nourishing Garden. <laughs> but no, I wanted to come and make a video just to give like a quick life update and what's been going on with me and where I've been. Um, I'm gonna try not to say um so much this video, but it's kind of like just a part of the way I talk. But, so I've had so much stuff going on. Sometimes life really be life and, and life really was life. -ing. So to be open, honest, vulnerable, and transparent, my ex-husband had to have emergency open heart surgery. Um, he's very young, I was only 34. And um, that really just shook me, right? Like it shook the hell out of me. And um, it's been a lot to, to, to cope with, to adjust with, but thanks to God, thanks be to God that he's doing a lot better. He's actually back at his house now and he's, you know, recovering. He's actually up and mobile. Um, he should be starting cardiac rehab, like maybe like next week sometime. So that had really consumed a lot of me, a whole lot of me. Um, I literally kind of stopped doing everything that I had going on to tend to and to be there and to support him through that challenging time in his life. And so um, that's where I've been for the most part. And then this election, I just could not. Um, I was really devastated at the results so I kind of want to talk about that a little bit I'm not gonna go too too deep into everything but if you are bothered worried sad about it so on and so forth I know we all kind of have had time to heal but I just want to encourage everybody to use this time to just be prepared and not to worry and I'm talking to myself too. Um, set yourself up in a position to where if you need to leave that you can Make sure that your family has their, your passports. Make sure that you have, um, you know, work on your finances so that you're able to put yourself in a position to move how it is that you need to move. Um, and so, yeah, I just had to say that because it, it, it was really, really rough for me to say the very least. Um, yeah, really rough, <laughs> but we are working through that. Um, and now that I've kind of come to terms with that as well, I've, you know, as the days go by, it's like I'm starting to feel better and better. Um, again, just because I feel as though there's nothing to worry about. The only thing we can do is prepare. So that's that with that. Um, but I really have missed YouTube and I really have a lot of ideas and things that I would like to bring into fruition for my channel. And so um, I definitely plan on doing vlogmas this year. I plan on doing quite a SARS <laughs> looking at a notification. But um, there's a lot that I desire to do and I will be back doing it. I have some old content that I never posted. Like I noticed that I was recording videos and just saving them and not ever putting them together whether it be me second guessing myself of maybe this video ain't good enough or I don't like the way this looks or, you know, maybe this isn't something that should be uploaded. I'm gonna post those things, you know, because it's a part of the journey. And I think that I just have to stop being so overly critical of everything and just get out there, right? So um, I have some things that I will be uploading and, um, I plan on doing vlogmas this year, so I'm ready. I will definitely be ready for that. Um, but all in all, it's good just to drop in, just to drop this video. I will definitely see you guys soon. For real, for real, for real. Okay. So uh, <laughs> thank you guys uh, for all of your support. And yeah, I will see you guys, guys if I can talk. I will see you guys very soon.